It's nearly spring and it's time to repair the pressure washer for jobs around the house. My first maintenance task to complete on uh, this Briggs & Stratton 675 series pressure washer is an engine oil change. The engine oil should be checked uh, daily or every eight hours of operation and should be changed uh, after the first five hours of operation when new and then every 50 hours of operation or annually after that first change. For this I'll be using uh, Briggs & Stratton SAE 30 um, oil which I was able to find at Lowe's for approximately $15. Uh, other items you're also going to need is a catch pan, a funnel, shop towels, uh, vinyl nitro gloves, and a 3 8 inch uh, ratchet with a uh, extension. Uh, there are two options when doing the, uh, the oil change on this. Uh, first option is to remove the uh, filler cap from the top, tip the, uh, the unit upside down uh, over the, the oil catch pan and allow it to drain that way and refill. Or in this particular model, there is an actual oil plug uh, which we will remove from the bottom of the engine and drain it that way. The engine oil plug is very difficult to see with the pressure washer in the upright position. However, once it's tipped over, you can see it on the underside of the unit located uh, right here. Uh, and as mentioned, that is a 3 8 inch drive. So what I like to do is loosen it up in this position with the ratchet and then complete the task by hand. Once I have it loose, I move the engine oil pan underneath and remove the bolt completely. Once the bolt's removed, simply turn the unit upright to allow for drainage. Once you're satisfied that the oil has been drained uh, from the crankcase, reinstall the engine oil plug. When filling, I recommend you do small amounts at first and check it to ensure that you do not overfill the crankcase. When checking, you should fully insert the dipstick to ensure it gets an accurate reading. The amount of oil required for your pressure washer will vary based on your model. However, this one took 20 ounces or approximately 590 milliliters. To dispose of the oil, oil I use a larger container to pour the, uh, the smaller amount into. Once this container is full, I bring it to a reuse center. Uh, and in this city, they are free to drop off. Right, oil change will keep your uh, pressure washer running throughout the season and is the first step to uh, use your pressure washer this spring. Thanks for watching.